Hello and welcome to this amazing video. I am Parin and today's video I am going to show you how to print all the worksheets in the workbook in a one go. And in case you want to print selected worksheet then you can do that as well. So let's get started. Here I have this workbook and I have three worksheets in the workbook summary, balance sheet and profit and loss account. And I have color coded this data so that is easier for you to follow. Now in this workbook, I want to print all these worksheets in a one go. So to do that, I would go to the file option here and then click on print. You can also use the keyboard shortcut control P. Now in this by default, this option is selected in a setting that print active sheets. And you can see here it says one of two because sheet one which was summary would be printed in a two parts because there is a data which is overflowing. If you want to print all the worksheet then you can simply change this option to print entire workbook and that's it. Now you can see it is one of four which is two pages for summary then one page for balance sheet and one page for profit and loss account. So just by changing this option this will print all the worksheet in the workbook. Now what if I if you do not want to print all the worksheet what if I just want to print summary and profit and loss account not balance sheet. So do that I would first have to select this two. So I have already this one selected which is summary. I would hold the control key and then click on profit and loss account. So you can see now these two sheets are grouped and you can see here in the name it says group here. Now once these two sheets are grouped again I go to file print and here instead of print entire workbook I would click on print active sheets and because these two sheets are grouped these are two sheets become active sheet so you can see here it's one of three two pages for summary and one page for profit and loss account so this is how you can select specific worksheet and then print those worksheets one important thing is to remember here is that when you group these sheets it is very important to ungroup this because in this case if I make changes here it would happen in all the sheets that are grouped. So ungroup right click and then click on ungroup or simply click on the sheet that is not part of the group. Now what if I want to print specific selection in all the sheets. So let's say for example in this case I want to print A1 to L33 and I want to bring this range in all the sheets of summary balance sheet and profit and loss account. So if I want to do that again so all I need to do simply group all the sheets so I would hold the control key and press all the sheets or you can hold the shift key press the first one which is already selected the first sheet and the last one and all the one in the middle would be selected. Now with all these grouped and this is selected I would again go to the file click on print and here I would click on the print selection as soon as I do that it only print the selection in each of the seeds and because I group all the seeds because all seeds are active seeds now it would be printed the same selection would be printed for all seeds so you can see one of four which is summary the same range for A1 to L33 same range for balance sheet and the same range for profit and loss account see in case you do not want to same range to be printed in the all the seeds let's say for again I'll ungroup the seeds I'm here ungrouping it now let's say I want to print this range for summary but for a balance sheet I want to print not the same range but let's say some other range uh, and profit and loss account I want to print this much here because these are different size range in the each sheet you will not be able to select it together and print what would you have to do set the print area so do that I would come to summary go to the page layout tab which with the selected I would click on print area and then click on a set print area now what this does it tells excel that this is the print area and when i'm printing this sheet only this area should be printed similarly balance sheet here with the selected go to print area set the print area and the same for profit and loss account see now if i want to print all these areas all i need to do is go to file print and here click on print entire workbook and it would only select that specific area that you have to set as a print area for that worksheet you can see here one of four now in this case it is a different range and in this case it is a different range in case you have a different size range then you would have to print this set area this is how you can print all the worksheet in excel or you can select specific worksheet and print only those worksheet 
that's it in this video i hope you found this useful also if you like this video please subscribe to the youtube channel and click on the bell icon so you never miss an update from our channel thank you